Hi everyone, welcome back to Lovely Girly Bits. I thought I would do another quick haul video. I know I just did one last week, um, but it was payday. I went to Limerick with Will for the weekend and we happened to take a little day trip to Cork where I did a, just a teeny tiny bit of shopping. Um, and I don't have to wait till the end of the month to show you the bits that I got because some of the stuff I think is nice because I bought it. Um, so it's in the shops in case you wanted to get it yourself. So first of all, I went into Penny's and I got this first. I thought it was really, really cute. Um, I wanted something like this, either love or home or something that I could put around the house. And I did see a really cute one in TK Maxx, a home one in um, kind of this colour wood and like a blue one. It's like 17 euros, so it's still in the back of my mind going, will I or won't I? But this and a penny is only 4 euros, which I thought was really good. I think it's just perfect. Just there. Next, um, I forgot to bring pyjamas with me to Limerick, so I went into Penny's um, to get some. Now, they're separates that I got, but they're just so comfy, and it's the type of pyjamas that you can wear. Um, and if someone knocks the door, you don't look like you're in pyjamas, which I think is really good. So I got these... Um, pajama bottoms first. They're like um, a light raspberry pinky colour and they're so soft but they're really light as well. Um, they've got like a little cuff at the bottom of the leg which they literally go down to the ankle. Um, drawstring that isn't really drawstring, it kind of just goes one, through one hole and out the other. That's what she said. Um, and there's a really cute little pocket on the back. So soft, light. I really like them. I think these were 7 euros which I thought was really good. And then to match them, um, I got this little pink, or no, purple um, t-shirt that has a little pocket here. And it has flecks of the pink that kind of matches this. So I thought this and this will be really, really cute together. I think the top was €5, Euros, so um, in total that's, what, 12 Um, And I know I'll get a lot of wear out of that, just kind of hanging around the house. I do love their fleece pyjamas so when it gets a little bit um, colder I will be buying those. Next I went into Awear. I was at the Awear Autumn Winter um, launch there on, I think it was on Thursday. There's so many nice things. So literally first thing, core straight Awear, have a look. And they have a lot of nice stuff so I want to go back in, try a few more bits on. But this caught my eye and I love it. It is 25 euros. And it's, um, I'm not exactly sure what colour it is. It looks brownie colour, the background colour, but I think it's more of a black. Um, and it just has like roses and whiny roses and nice grainy leaves. And it's like a mirror print as well. Um, and the black at the back is just black um, cotton material. So it's really comfortable on, but it's really, really nice on and quite dressy because this material is kind of like a silk even though it's not silk um, and I just think that is so cute they do a really nice white one which I'll probably go back in to get because I kind of want it now that I've thought about it so the next top I got you're all going to think I'm absolutely nuts um, I may have it in two colours and I may have bought it in a third colour don't judge me I just love them and I know I've already gotten a lot of wear out of the green one and the, the raspberry pink one that I have and yes I got it in black it's the same new look top that kind of goes across at the front a dip at the back um, 17.99 yeah and I know I've bought three I know but then I saw I think that on um, by now blog later she put up a picture on her Instagram of an outfit that she wore and she had a top similar to this with the kind of same front of the crossover but it had sleeves that came to I think her elbow and it was in white and she got it in top shop and I saw that and I was like oh my god I have to google that to see how much it is because I kind of want that now myself I kind of got a little bit insane getting four things the same but if you wear them I think there's no harm so don't judge me um, and then the last thing I bought was this top. Now, I have nothing like this in my wardrobe, and I don't know why I thought I'd like it, because I've never really worn anything like this before. But it's just a sleeveless, kind of high neck, whiny coloured top with um, off whitey polka dots. But there's an elastic band at the bottom of the top, so it's quite flowy and loose. 
it's kind of two layers, the polka dot layer here and then like a, just a whiny colour layer on the inside so it's not see through at all. Um, and it just, it just falls really nicely and it just stops kind of right just a little bit above your hip um, so it just sits really really nice and I think that I like a dark pair of denim jeans or something maybe long earrings since I won't be able to wear a necklace with that I think it would be really nice um, that was also $17.99 which I thought was really really good and probably if they had them in more colours they probably would have picked up one. Oh god I'm a bit mad I know um, and then Will went off shopping himself and when he came back he got me two little surprises, which I haven't really looked at yet, but I can't wait. First one is a bridal magazine. I have two already that I've kind of flicked through, but this one, ooh, I can't wait to open. Um, it comes with a CD with flowers. Oh, I think I know what flowers I want for my bouquet. The rest is kind of up in the air. Ooh. And then there's also, I just saw this now, 116 page honeymoon guide. Oh, I guess to go on honeymoon. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, so yeah, I can't wait to open this. Let me know in the comments below if you'd like me to do some videos on wedding planning. Um, we're literally kind of just starting to get the thinking caps on about that one. So it's quite exciting. I don't want to bore you in these type of videos about stuff like that. But if you want me to do separate wedding videos or planning videos or whichever just let me know in the comments below and I will oblige and then last but not least he knows I love Wagamamas and he knows I love their yakisoba literally whenever we go in there I think it's the one thing I've actually only ever had besides maybe a couple of side orders with it I actually don't think I've ever had anything but yakisoba in Wagamamas so he bought me the Wagamama cookbook and it has the yakisoba recipe in it which I will have to try and make this weekend but um, I'll show you the picture of it. It's this here. Mm. It's my favorite thing, and I think it's healthy. Um, it doesn't have the calorie in it, but it's all just vegetables and noodles and chickens and prawns. But it looks good. It's such a good book. Whether the stuff is as easy to make, um, God knows. But I am gonna give this a try, and I can't wait to have like a good proper flick through because I do need to cook more so that is the plan so that's all I got this weekend which I think is enough and um, I spent enough money again apologies on how I look we literally just ran in the door doing this I have to have a shower and get ready and go to bed so that's it so thanks for watching and um, if you like the video please like subscribe and leave some comments below and we'll chat to you soon bye